All right, bro, so I got you covered for the summer here with the 10 essential items you're gonna need in your wardrobe for the upcoming summer. Now, the cool thing about this video is that these pieces will be in style for every single season. These pieces are not your trendy pieces. These are the only 10 items you need in your wardrobe to go out and look your best in the summertime. Now, boys, up first is a linen shirt. Exactly what I'm wearing right now. It's light, it's breathable. You can actually wear it out during the day. You can wear it out during night. It's something that it's very easy to throw on and easy to lay Layer with some of your outfits. So you're almost going for that flowy kind of vibe. A linen shirt is gonna give off that edgy, but I don't care kind of style. This is not the restricted outfit where you're gonna wear this shirt very tight. For myself personally, let's say I wear a size small, I would usually buy a size medium in this to have that more relaxed fit. As for the summertime, bro, you wanna be very relaxed and comfortable as it gets very hot. And you don't wanna be that dude in the club wearing your linen shirt really tight around your arms where you can see your armpit stains. Especially for myself, man, in the summertime, I usually sweat a little bit more. So this is why I usually wear stuff less restrictive. And not to mention the linen shirt just gives off that old money aesthetic vibe. And that style, boys, will be in trend every single year. Light wash denim jeans is up next for the boys. Light wash denim jeans, guys, is an essential piece to have in your wardrobe for the summer. As if you're somebody that's wearing a lot of colorful t-shirts, the over shirts, the linen shirts, your white t-shirts, this is just a basic jean that you need in your wardrobe. This is gonna pair up very easily with any shoe in your wardrobe. And not to mention, in the summertime, it's nice to wear brighter colors and show off a bit more of your personality. As bro, you gotta get outside your comfort zone, man. Stop wearing black or gray. You gotta start experimenting more with wearing some color in your wardrobe. And the light wash denim jean is a perfect way to start. It's the perfect in-between. And I think it's a great stepping point for someone that doesn't really love to add a lot of color into their wardrobe. And I don't wanna hear it, bro. You gotta stop wearing black all the time. As people really notice that stuff, man. If you start changing it up, you wouldn't believe leave the amount of compliments you're gonna get. Up next is short shorts. And yes, boy, short shorts are super in style right now. I don't think it's going anywhere. Like, I don't think I'll be wearing a pair of shorts that go below my knees anymore. As this is the gym bro aesthetic where guys wear the oversized t-shirt with the high socks. Now you're probably thinking, when would you wear this look? When would I wear short shorts, bro? Nando, like, what are you doing to me? When would I wear this, bro? If you think about it, when you don't feel like wearing jeans or cargo pants or trousers, and you just feel like wearing your running shoes with a high sock, bro, this is where you could throw those comfortable cotton short shorts on with your baggy oversized t-shirt, a cap, a pair of glasses. Bro, you can swag this out a lot, trust me. Like, just take a look at this outfit here, bro. Like, come on, like, this is pretty sick. It shows that you put effort, but you didn't at the same time, right? Like, that's what you wanna go for sometimes. It's that really chilled, relaxed look. You don't have to put a lot of effort in. It's completely effortless. Now, up next, the flowy summer shirt. You're gonna hear me saying flowy a lot when I talk about summer essentials, right? You wanna be nice and relaxed, boys. Like, this is a really dope style to wear with your tank top. This is where you change the length of your shirts, right? So let's say you have this tank top on. This is where you can tuck the tank top in and let this flowy shirt do its thing, bro. Let it hang out, right? Like just let it do its thing. You can either button up halfway. You can leave it open completely. It doesn't matter. This is where you can play with different patterns, textures with your outfit. This is where you get to show off a little bit more skin because this is a t-shirt, right? So you can obviously show off a little bit more of the arms. You've been training a lot. This is where you get to show off your biceps and triceps a lot, bro. And you don't have to be restricted with this either. If you wanted to wear this a bit tighter on the arms, I wouldn't say it's as bad. But in my personal opinion, I would wear this a bit more relaxed like this outfit here. Bro, I don't know how many more times you want me to say this, man. Like tank tops are super in style and they're not gonna go anywhere, guys. It's very easy to layer this stuff with your outfits. This is the main base of any outfit you put together. As guys, in the summertime, wearing a t-shirt or a polo shirt can become very boring. You can't add any depth or look or change to your outfit. As you can either tuck this tank top into your trousers or your jeans jeans or your chino pants or your linen pants. Or you could just leave it out and be more relaxed. Now the cool thing about this, that this is so in style right now, that's totally cool just to wear the tank top by itself. And trust me, I never thought that I'd be sitting here telling you boys to wear a tank top. But this is really cool boys, because it's gonna show off a lot more skin. It's gonna show a lot more of your chest muscles, your arms, your shoulders, your back. And if you're someone that's been training a lot, this is a super nice piece to add to your wardrobe to show off the body you've been working so hard for. I think tank tops are gonna be a real staple in a man's wardrobe going forward as it almost acts like the inner vest of the outfit. I honestly think, bro, you're gonna start laughing, but the tank top is like the upper body version of your boxers. It's the main base of your upper body. You can start from here and then build your outfit up. Up next is chunky sneakers, and man, these are not going anywhere. As the chunky sneaker has become such a popular trend in today's day, as New Balance has really took this to another level, as guys are really wearing this New Balance 550 shoe. This is an absolute essential to have in your 
your wardrobe because bro, if you think about it, if you start wearing your linen pants or your short shorts or your baggier jeans, you need a shoe that's gonna really hold the weight and look of that pant. You can't be pairing up your baggier looks with your slimmer shoes. So bro, I don't know what you're waiting for right now. Open up another link right now as you're watching this video and order a white chunky sneaker. Start off with white, bro. Be very basic, be very simple. You don't need to overcomplicate this as this is gonna go with every single outfit in your wardrobe throughout the summer. Up next is the vintage polo. Now for those of you guys that really love this old money aesthetic vibe, then bro, this is the perfect shirt for you to get for the summertime as this really gets to show off that style. This is your very basic, dapper, kind of relaxed look that you could start wearing out to dinners, nightclubs, events, day parties. You can be very versatile with this shirt. You can pair this up with your linen pants, your jeans, your black trousers, and you can play with the different patterns or textures of this shirt as well. You can even get shirts with the zipper that looks really, really nice as well. If you have a nice high choker necklace chain, that looks really cool. As bro, this is gonna really elevate your style. You gotta get outside your comfort zone, man. That's why I love when you guys watch this YouTube channel because I really hope it opens your eyes with some of your style choices. So up next is sunglasses, bro. You're missing out a lot, man. If you don't put a pair of sunglasses on your face, you're missing out on a lot of style that you can add to your face, a lot of structure and depth to your outfit. Let's say you're going out for a day party, you're going out to a dinner. This is where you can throw on your sunglasses or your clear frames, as this is gonna add a lot of style and elevation to your look. But for the springtime, I would stick to something more basic, man, like black or brown. Something a lot thinner and smaller. I wouldn't go for such a bigger size frame for your face. Sunglasses should be the last finishing touch to the outfit. You take a look at yourself in the mirror, you look at your outfit, and this is where you throw on your sunglasses as the finishing touch. This is like the cologne to your grooming routine. The sunglasses are like the cologne, but to your style. So finish it off with a nice pair of sunglasses, bro, and I guarantee it's gonna add a lot of depth and structure to your fit. Now up next is swim trunks. I feel like a lot of guys, man, they miss out on a good pair of swim trunks, right? Like you guys kind of, you know, maybe get a little bit lazy with this. You start putting on your billabongs where they're going past your knees or your Harley. I don't even know what they're called, man. Like the Harley, the hand, I don't even know what they're called. But anyways, you're missing out on a big opportunity to give a lot of more style to your outfit. Let's say you're going out to the beach, you're going out for vacation. You need a nice pair of five, six, five to seven inch swim trunks, bro, okay? Yo, don't come at me in the comments. I probably wouldn't wear anything longer than a seven inch bathing suit, to be honest with you. I just don't think it looks, I just don't think that style is in anymore where the bathing suit goes past your knees anymore. I'm just saying, bro. But you have a nice bathing suit on, you got your tank top, you got your flowy overshirt with your sandals, your flip flops. Bro, you're gonna look really aesthetic. You're gonna look really put together, like you put a lot of thought into it. Now, the very last thing you need for the summer is jewelry accessory, boys. Like, this is how you're gonna really elevate the style. This is where you can stack up your chains on your chest, stack up your wrists with some bracelets, your hands with some rings, a nice watch. As in the summertime, guys, there's not really much you could do with an outfit other than your jewelry accessories. Get creative, start wearing some white pearls, some brown or black pearls on the wrist, around your neck, some gold or silver chains. This is where you can play with that stuff, bro. You can actually get away with it because it's the summertime. People know there's not much to do in the summertime other than really show off the jewelry. This is where you can get carried away with wearing at least three chains around the chest area like you guys see me right now. This is gonna really elevate those t-shirts sometimes. When you're just wearing a black t-shirt in the summer, bro, you can't just go out with a black t-shirt in the summer, man. Like, think about it. If you go out with a plain black t-shirt or white t-shirt, you're missing out on throwing on a really nice chain, a really nice silver or gold chain. Don't be that guy, bro. Be that guy that puts the extra effort into the outfit. As I guarantee you, people really notice those little things, man. Like, even when you go out with girls, man, you'll be surprised how many girls will compliment you on a nice ring, a nice chain, or a bracelet, or a nice watch. So there you have it, boys, the 10 summer essentials that you need for the summertime. And again, don't forget to hit that subscribe button as I'm posting content like this every single week. I don't want you guys to miss it. But until then, I'll see you all in the next video.